Hello everyone, it's Frances from Your Book of Memories. I've got a quick project to share with you guys today. I created this mini using the Neapolitan Collection from Recollections Now. This was in my stash again, so I'm trying to use all the paper. So this measures, let me see, I think it is seven, yes, seven by five and a half, and then the spine measures roughly two and a half inches. So it's a pretty chunky album. Uh, so here on the front cover, I just fussy cut a heart out from the, uh, just some regular cardstock, and then I did my journaling lines, and then I popped it up, as well as these two stickers. This was actually a long sticker, so it had a sticker collection, it had some banners that were like sewn together on this 12 by 12 sheet, so that was really cool. I was surprised I had that much of the paper left and I hadn't used it, so it's kind of summery, springy. And so I cut this in half and I just mounted it on some white cardstock and then cut around it. And of course I got some more lace trim and I did some paint smudging. Uh, took a break on the paint splatter this time, and here on the spine, you can see it's pretty chunky. Let me bring it closer. I just did some assortments of ribbon here. We got satin gray, some more of that lace, and I attached it with the Tim Holtz jump ring, Brad, and then we got the back. Super cute floral paper right there. I love it, and the music note paper for the spine. So I'm going to refocus. Alright, that looks good. So here on the front cover, I just have like this cute little burlap flower from my friend Terry. Thank you again, Terry. I'm using them up. And then we got two pockets here. So this was a strip. This is like a little border strip from the paper collection. And then I cut this little cute um, mason jar out of one of the pages. It was so cute. Let the fun begin. Look at these little balloons. It's kind of like a watercolor feel to it. Oh my God. This paper is just, I love it. And of course, I made my own little tab there and cut out a couple banners. This is another sticker from the sticker collection, as well as this in the back. And then we have those little banners. So here's a great spot for a photo and another one of those cute little burlap flowers. And this flips up. See if you can see that. Some more photo space. Heart, just cut that out. And then I made a little pocket. Oh my god, look at the strawberries. So we got strawberries, we got ice cream, we got lollipops, mason jars, scooters. This paper is so cute. And so I made uh, some uh, tags at the top, so that's kind of cool. And this actually opens for more photo space. Uh, I had a lot of paper left, so I wanted to use, you know, I want to maximize that. So that just goes right back up there. And you flip it over here, and I attach this cute little, oh my god, look at this little cut apart. Some music note paper on the back of there, and this just came from my friend Amy. It's a Stampin' Up! star-shaped paper clip. Super cute. Thank you, Amy. Another one of those cute flowers, perfect spot for a photo. And a couple more of these little, I'm telling you, this, this collection had a couple cool things. And so we got these little guys. This flips over a little spot for a photo there. Some journaling on this side. Let me open this and, and we got more journaling. And this cute little flower from the sticker collection. And then again, I fussy cut this out, add some journaling lines on the back of there. And then this slips out too. Photos on the front and back of that. And super cute, a tight squeeze for me to use. <laughs> that just fit perfectly right there on that page. And here's the uh, pull out for this one. Super duper cute. Look at the, f oh my god, look at the flowers and the, come on, people. I just want to eat one of those ice creams right now. <laughs> it is super hot over here. Let me see if I'm focused really quick. Another cute little flower, and from the sticker collection, it had this little arrow. I thought it was so adorable. My God, look at it. And super cute striped paper. I love the watercolor details. Oh, I didn't even talk about the front. Sorry. Here we have this cute little um, dictionary definition page. Oh, my God, summer. That part of the year which comprises of June, July, and August. A happy period. Totally. And I am burning up over here. <laughs> and a uh, cute little journaling paper. I just used it for this because I thought it went well with the... Um, colors on this one. Flip this down and you have my girl spot for a photo. And then you have another cute pocket here and we got some pullouts. Look at that. Super cute. I just love this. Here's the insert for this one. This is what I fussy cut all the little jars out of. Super cute. So that'll give you some more photo space. You can fit four to four photos right there already. You just trim down a four by six photo just a little bit. Am I in frame? Yes I am. On this side, just simple photo mats, some more of those heart stickers. And then, oh, so lovely. I love their flats. It's like, these colors are just divine. Look at this. Little star. And then I just made it a little pocket, and it's a flap that opens up. Got a little tag over here. Fussy cutting. 
and then you make this makes me so happy look at this ice cream delightful and there's that adorable mason jar page right there here's the answer for this one. Oh, look at oh my god i'm gonna cry it's ridiculous it just slips back in here and so this is a three-eighths of an inch gusset no this is half an inch guys so it's pretty chunky you can fit some pictures in here so if it gets chunkier you're able to still uh, make up for that so here again oh and i did some paint smudging on all the pages as well and this i love this pocket with this i mean come on i popped him up a little bit i'm gonna call her her actually <laughs> popped her up perfect spots for photos right there bingo and that is it guys look at this just fussy cut these out i mean this is just so cute. It's like, it just, I just love it so much. And here's the back, and I finished it off with some of that lace you saw. And that is it, guys. Thanks so much. And don't forget to check out my Facebook art page at Your Book of Memories. Thanks. Bye.